Welcome to Good Mythical More. Two days between now and Valentine's Day. Woo. Less depending on when you watch this and Woo. how you count days. Yep. Um, but we are going to taste the best Valentine's Day candies that you should get and eat. But mm, first. Because they're good. We're going to do a freeze frame. <gasps> I refuse. Let, I've been doing, I think I do that in every single one now. I like do something that's like creates, not actually creates a motion blur. Yeah. And who knows what they've done. Come to on us. in. Win it. It's the bright hey. spot in all of your shopping now. Hey. Quinted. Hey, everyone. Quinted. Quinted. Ooh, I made a big squeak when I sat. Quinted. Did you hear that? Yep. It was a tiny little whoop cushion. Oof. That's not um, good. How you doing? Good. You got plans for uh, V Day? For Valentine's Day? Mm -hmm. I actually do. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. You and your rock star hubby are just gonna romance it up? We're going to a Tool concert. Oh, snap! Is that okay. romantic? Very. Uh, yeah, it sounds like, it looks like you're into it. It's romantic in a really 90s way, which I like. Yeah. Tool, I mean, the musicianship of that band is uh, rather impressive. I'll say. You know, even if you don't, if you're not a fan of Tool, mm -hmm. right, you gotta respect Tool. Yeah, definitely. It's I don't think I'm like a huge Tool, tool right. fan, but. It's enough to get you in the mood. Definitely. You know, to, oh, see, people, the mood. to see people. Because <laughs> yeah, that's what, it's kind of aggressive. Isn't that what Valentine's Day plans are? It's a, like everything's yeah. designed for like, you know, to, to get the gears going and things, Grease right? them wheels, yeah. Right. Uh -huh. I remember that um, one of their albums, it had an, like an, was that your back? I keep squeaking, I'm sorry, okay. Uh, I, thought, I thought your <laughs> spine cracked. Oh my God. No, there's something about my jeans in this chair that's being disruptive, I'm sorry. I remember the album had animation. Yeah. Do you that, know what I'm talking about? The vi It was the video for, um, for what is it? But Sober, what was, what right? Was, what was being animated is not something I want to describe. Okay. Oh, okay. Do you know what I'm talking I about? I actually kind of don't. I can't remember. Okay, well. You can whisper it to uh, me? No, uh, your husband can do it at the concert. Okay. Oh, so, fair. Um, okay. <laughs> yeah, I just don't want to, I don't want to be a part of it. I brought it up though. <laughs> okay. I thought sure you already did. knew about it. <laughs> I just remember going like that and be like, oh, that, oh, that's possible. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Oh, I was that like, is oh. possible. It was a, it was a that little was, too, it was, okay. It was like a hologrammy kind of it, thing? Yeah, it was a. That was that was a big thing in the Man. 90s. You could I didn't do know, that. That's so that cool. That's possible. Let Valentine's Day candies. Yeah, let's keep it with candy. Let's do it. All right. So <laughs> let's start over there. Okay. So we're starting with these are Valentine's crunchy clusters. The okay. brand is Favorite Day, which is sold at Target. Um, this so, looks very artisanal, as you would say, right? Mm -hmm. I would say it. So we've got like pretzels. They're quite large. We have oh. pretzels. And caramel. And oh, then some, is that some white chocolate? Oh, chewy. White chocolate. Drizzle, white drizzle. It's drizzle. Mm. Sprinkles. Oh, it's loud. It's a could, little hard I, to bite, but. Mm. I could see you enjoying these at the Tula concert. <laughs> <laughs> Bring definitely. a whole bag of these for everybody. I'm definitely going to, yeah. That was the thought. Um, Who's opening? Oh, no. I kind of can't remember, which is really bad. All right. Don't Lane Staley. Anyone. These are good. That's really. These are good. They're really tasty. Mm -hmm. They're really good, right? Like something about that white chocolate is really working too. I know. With the caramel and then the saltiness of the pretzels, I think these mm. are mm -hmm. amazing. And if you bought them for someone for Valentine's Day, they'd love you a lot. So that is in our number one slot. Mm -hmm. Let's see if it can be th dethroned mm -hmm. by. Oops, sorry. Okay. Starburst Conversation Hearts. Oh. So, Conversation Hearts, you know, they're always like small and chalky and printed with things that you can't read. But it's usually like, be mine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But this is like, you got this. Mm -hmm. Juicy. Oh, yeah. sweet. Be mine is still one. I got a hashtag, do you. Okay. <laughs> um. I wanna. Oh, see, get it. <laughs> Uh, Hashtag do you. <laughs> be pink. That's a little suggestive. Okay. No, it's not. You can fave. read them. It depends on how your mind works. What do you mean you can read them? 
Mm, we are just reading them. No, I know. I'm what saying versus regular sweethearts that you're used to. You remember oh, how they were printed in ink and they were like, yeah, exactly. They're using a better tool. This is, <laughs> hey. Elder is, this... is opening for tool. Who? Who? Elder? Elder? Oh. No. Just, just arrived late. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stay in the uh, parking lot for a while. <laughs> <laughs> Eat some hearts. Yeah, eating candy. Less than three. Did you taste one? Yeah, I didn't love it. You don't love them? Okay. I like them better than regular conversation hearts. They're more like sweet tarts or something. Uh, like they're a little tangy. Okay, you're they're right. They're not nearly as chalky. Mm-hmm. You're right, they're so better. it is an improvement. Juicy. How, how would you use these in like a... <laughs> this is to make a trail. Oh, oh a trail. This is to make a trail there to, the you go. to the bedroom. Or to the tool concert. Mm-hmm. That's trail. smart. So it's like rose petals, but edible? That's the whole purpose. A lot of people are like, what are these little hearts for? No one sits and eats them. I think you could. They're made for making trails. You can mm-hmm. make a homemade uh, card, and then you could, you could instead of saying be pink, you could, in the sentence, you could put that in there. Mm-hmm. It's just like, I always love you because you be pink. Yeah, okay. That, and you know what? Let's do something Hashtag juicy. do you, Lane. <laughs> Dear baby, you're sweet. <laughs> and then you just glue him on there. Yeah. And then she's eating glue, and you know what happens after that. That's right. <laughs> An ER visit. Yeah. Have you ever left a trail? For either, you know, have you, either you ever left a trail? I'm not a no, trail I've person. I've never left a trail. Yeah. I'm thinking yes. about maybe leaving trails now. <laughs> I've never left a trail. I would like to encourage you to take this bag home and leave a trail. I've thought about it, but then I'm just like, the dogs are going to eat the trail. Are we going? Oh, but yeah. Yeah, you got to send the dogs out, then you leave a trail. I bet these wouldn't kill dogs. Is this? But they would eat them all. Yeah. Barbara it's, would. It sounds like you're not sure, though. <laughs> I mean, we kind of need to, you know. I am a vet, but. <laughs> Barbara, Barbara would eat these and then leave a trail of diarrhea. That's what would happen. <laughs> yeah. And then it would be like, the whole night would be ruined. Right? Yep. You know when the dog oh, gets into you. something they shouldn't get in? Oh, that's a bad night. I know. So are, are we dethroning this? The crunchy No way, because... it's not better. I mean, you can leave a tra- I can leave a trail with these pretzels. Yeah, that's true. Mm-hmm. All right, and next we have... We have a bowl of strawberry, what are they called? Strawberry, oh, I have a card. Chocolate? Stra- chocolate yeah. dipped strawberry kisses. Look, I have a card. Um, Is it Hershey's? We, yeah, they're Hershey's okay. kisses. Um, one yeah. of them's unwrapped. That's yours. <laughs> <laughs> We don't, we don't I mean, there's plenty. Don't it doesn't have to been. be anybody's. I know. I just already like, put it in my mouth. I know it's going to be hard for them. <laughs> I, I I'll pre unwrap it. Is that what you did? Well, then why is it unwrapped? Whoa! Goo. Bite into that. Goo. Soft red goo. Mm-hmm. I didn't know this was a thing. Do you like it? What? I like it better than a regular Hershey's kiss because it's just. I do too. Regular Hershey's kiss is just mm. solid. Mm-hmm. Milk chocolate. Mm-hmm. Unless you like put it on top of a cookie, it's just. It's. Do they do this with peanut butter? Do they have a peanut butter one? Oh, no. Wow. Well, what an what oversight. They, that's what they should do. Dang, um, they could be killing a game. It's a crowded market for peanut butter chocolate. I mean, everybody sure. loves Hershey's Kisses. Hey, you know, I love it. <laughs> this is not super, like, over aggressively strawberry, mm-hmm. which. It makes me like it a lot. Me yeah, too. it doesn't taste fakey. Mm-hmm. And it make, would make a good Agreed. trail. Again, no dogs in the house, though. So. Yep. That will kill dogs, it in will. my professional opinion. Mm-hmm. Okay, so let's put this at number two, I'm, I'm thinking. You know what? I like to always make the warning. A lot of people don't know this. It's news to people every time. Grapes also kill dogs. <sighs> don't drop grapes around your dogs. That? Did that happen to you? What's the <laughs> sigh? I made a sigh like I had killed a dog that way, but that's not what happened. I was, um, what did happen? I was eating, okay, I was eating peanuts and raisins in bed the other day. Yep. And um, my cat was begging for food, so I gave him raisins. Which are grapes. Which are grapes. And I was immediately like, oh crap, I shouldn't have done that. I don't, is, did um, you Google or is it you find cats like, in the same way it affects dogs? So I Google and Google will give you a lot of conflicting information okay. on the subject. Right. So I had to call and I'm like animal poison control. Yep, we've done oh. that a few times. Did they tell you to do a feline lick? <laughs> <laughs> feline lick maneuver, I love just that. Just sounds like you um, licking no. a cat. They charge you $95 just for calling. Oh yeah, yeah, I've done it. And then they say, 
No, cats can eat raisins. It's fine. Bye. <laughs> but but they take your. They're like, can I get your credit card number before I tell you what you like, really need to know? One hundred percent. Really? <laughs> yeah. No. Oh, listen. <laughs> So I called. I, didn't tell I my did the same the service. <laughs> hey, and let me tell you right now, they made you sign up for the service, to, uh -huh. and then you, so they're going to charge you again next month because they did that to me, and I had to. It was very difficult to cancel. Oh no! Well, I'll have to just feed the cat something else, maybe poisonous. So Why didn't you my, just my money? Google, y'all. It uh, tells you all to Google because it, yeah, I, I can't remember what it was for us, but Jesse was like, just you, read you, the thing. You, you gotta call hear. this. You gotta call this line, yeah. and then I was like, and then I like. Go on there, and then I'm like doing a chat or something, and then it's like, oh, ninety five dollars, and I'm like, oh god, it's worth it. It's a dog; they might die. Yes. And then they charge me another ninety five the next month. Oh, man. I I am upset about this because what they've done is they've taken poison control, they privatized it, and they make you think it's the same thing, but they're 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 charging you for it. This is highway robbery. They're capitalizing on your anxiety about your doggies. Totally. Yeah, it's quite a market. But, and it's so much cheaper than going to the emergency vet, which costs. Well, that's true. Yeah. All right, so it's a deal. a million right. dollars. Right. I'm gonna stay out of it. Okay, next we have Reese's Pink Hearts. Oh. Oh, we're talking about the peanut <laughs> butter, and here it is. Oh, that's got <laughs> peanut butter inside. It's an yeah. interesting color. It's, it's almost purple. Is it white chocolate that's just been made pink? It's a very interesting shape, too. <laughs> yeah. It's kind of like the most turdish version <laughs> of a heart. You mean like a booty? It reminds me of something else, I guess. Oh, yours is oh. upside down. <laughs> oh, boy. I'm trying to be. <laughs> okay, say it. Nothing wrong with that. Be my, I just saw clarify. you thinking like, how long am I gonna do this motion and wait for one of them to notice me? At what <laughs> point do I, I was gonna say What does it out, remind you of? Dangly balls. Dangly oh, balls, oh. she says. Yep. Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> it tastes on. great, though. Speaking of dangly balls, these taste um, so good. I mean, if you just come to Reese's for the peanut butter and don't care that much about the chocolate, I think these absolutely rule. There's so much peanut butter inside. They call it pink cream, but it, it, I mean, it's basically white chocolate. Yeah, it doesn't really taste like much of anything. It's just like a sweet coating. What 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 is the sensation of having pink balls? I guess that's just normal for me. <laughs> uh, this yeah this. Yeah, I think. What do you mean? As opposed to blue. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, Gwyneth, that it took sorry. me so long to see you dangling the balls. I know. Everywhere. Sometimes okay. we really engage. let we really let you out to dry on that one. <laughs> well, I just shouldn't engage. Hmm. Do you like them? I think this is. I really love them. It. You know us and I peanut butter and our bias. Mm -hmm. That's why I was really excited for you guys. The peanut butter this. bias? Mm -hmm. I thought you were literally saying our biosphere. You know we're starting a biosphere. <laughs> oh my God. And uh, it's gonna Count be filled with peanut butter. Peanut butter and Polly Shore. All right, okay. so here we go with. Um. Oh, these are Jet Puff Strawberry Heart Marshmallows. I actually haven't tried these yet, so. Choking hazard. Ah. Eat no. one at a time. For children under four, cut marshmallows into bite-sized pieces. Children should always be seated and supervised while eating. Why do you have to sit down to eat marshmallows? Do not make a trail. Is that a do thing? Do not make a trail. Is that a thing, You're choking on marshmallows? Does it really say all of those children things? Children should always be seated. I feel like a marshmallow what? melts in your throat. Let's find out, swallow one whole. <laughs> <laughs> melts in your lung. I think that if you get it in the esophagus. Most in your lung, not in your I hands. I think the saliva will. I Eventually. It's not like getting a hot dog in there. That'll kill you. <laughs> oh, it's a it's a anti-chubby bunny trend. That's what I was going to say. So oh, you, yes. They say that's we what happens. Time. It's a tasty marshmallow. Does but, it got hoof in it? But the seeded part. Chubby bunny is not I'm a running around yeah. kind of sport. Yeah, I don't know about the seeded part. Maybe it. Oh, sorry, Matt Carney would like to comment on the well, seated part. In having it's a two-year-old myself, when children run around with food in their mouth, they're much more likely to choke, and it may not melt fast enough. If, if those are throat-shaped candies, they get lodged in there real easy when they're running you around. You don't want to take any chances. Yeah, it's like not on, not on one of these. Children. Yeah, I put this I last. Guess. I just don't give a crap. Okay, sure. Um, I think they're a little bit better than the candy hearts, but I think the candy hearts make a better trail, so I'm willing to keep them in last. Perfect. Also, I don't know. They don't taste that much like strawberry, and that's kind of their why they is exist. Is this a bento box? What Are you having this? fun? 
I'm having so much fun. I love this thing. Okay, so this is from Target. It's favorite day. Cupid's candy box. So it's and like a tackle box. Yeah, it is. How long has this favorite gummy. day brand been around? I don't know, actually. It seems relatively new, like past few years, but they make fun fun so, holiday so we got candy a, and stuff. White gummy. We've got a red gummy. We've so, got a... Oh, I thought this was chocolate, but this is a gummy. Oh, it's another gummy? It's a. It's all gummies. It's all gummies? Yep. Everything is gummies. So okay. you I got, got your heart. And then we got gummy bears. Bears, red bears, white bears. I'm minute. curious about the white bears because they're opaque and eat? it makes them look like they taste like milk, but I highly doubt that they do. Just want to remind you, uh, you can go to Spork mm. and use the trusty search bar mm. to search best Valentine's Day candy, or just search Valentine's Day candy if you're lazier. And uh, what's gonna pop up is the best Valentine's Day candies to buy last minute or on sale on the day after V-Day. Mm -hmm. um, That's when to do it. So uh, use that search bar over at Spork for anything that you like. Now I will say, a feature that should not be overlooked. It comes with stickers. So right under there, no there are stickers that are letters that you can then personalize. And this one on the back has been personalized for Arden. That's Arden's so candy box. That's too fun. I feel like that moves this thing up because I'm just kind of putting together the way I'm gonna do it. So I'm gonna have a candy heart trail. Halfway, halfway on the trail, it's gonna be Jessie's tackle box. Because <laughs> uh, it will be a tackle box mm -hmm. later because she's big into fishing. Okay, yeah, she seems like She put like all her flies in there. <laughs> so I put that like halfway up the stairs full of gummies. And really the gummies are for me, I'm a gummy guy. And then, whoa, I'm caught. Oh no! <laughs> what is that? Whoa, it bit you. And, uh, and then you just continue on the trail and I gotta figure out what's next, but I just feel like this is somewhere up in here. It's not better than this, though. No, I I agree. It's, have, but maybe they don't. Here? But have you tasted them? Because they taste strange. Mm -hmm. Which ones did, did you, you have? The I saw did you have the white the, the white thing, and it tasted like it was rose flavored or something, <gasps> flowered. Oh, weird. The gummy bear tasted like banana. The white one tastes like banana to me. I don't like the X's and the O's. Yeah, I, like I don't like the X's. They're I'm like a, gum, a, a weird, it's like a yogurt gummy thing. It's weird. Yeah, they're um. I hate it. He hates it. Well, I want to taste a little. But that is ranked I'm fourth. just one vote. I'm gonna get some more of these because this is nice, though. I have to say, I was really influenced by the packaging with this one because I can think of so many things to do with this box. Yeah, like you beads. Your, your beads. Beads. In there. Yeah. Exactly. It's exactly what I said. <laughs> you, it's a perfect bead organizer. I don't have any beads, but I'll get some. Right. It, it motivates you to get into beads. Mm -hmm. I think I put pills in there. Oh yeah. You know. I got a lot of pills these days. <laughs> well, that's that's nine slots though, so that's just nine days. It's gonna be a weird cycle. No, because then you put the different types of pills in the instead of doing this a is day, one day it's for not you. Daily. Instead of a day, it's <laughs> like all your omega threes are in one section. So then you just open it up and you're just like, Brr. you know how many of each thing that's you not, take. That's not. You don't want to do that, old man. <laughs> Why not? I've done that before. You got to keep your medication by day. No, I don't. <laughs> no, you that don't. That's the rules. I'm just trying, it's not trying not to leave it's, a trail it's for not you. not really medications, you know. Head to spork.com to find the best Valentine's Day candy as tasted and ranked by the Spork team.